Hi church, um, I want to bring you this message because um, as a prayer team we felt that what God has been um, showing us um, and saying uh, we needed to bring to the church. So um, uh, it's been brought to the leaders and they, they thought it would be okay and it would be good to, to do this. So um, so uh, it's, it's in relation to a um, prophetic uh, picture that, that Jane did, not yesterday, but the Sunday before. And it was of the world with um, uh, Gower New Life Church marching round the world with trumpets. And so the, the message is um, in relation to, to trumpets, but it, it's, it's based in Joel. Um, and I'll come back to the trumpets, but I just want to give you an overall of what, what God God was, was revealing um, chapter one is is a call to repentance. Um, it talks about the, um, the the coming invasion of the locusts, locust, but it, it, it's a call to repentance. And in in verse fourteen, it it says, "Declare a holy fast, call a sacred assembly, summon the elders and all who live in the land." to the house of the Lord your God, and cry out to the Lord. Alas for the day, for the day of the Lord is near. It will come like destruction from the Almighty. So that, that's that's talking about, you know, calling a holy fast and call a sacred assembly. Um, and it's talking about um, the, the end times, about Jesus, Jesus coming back and the destruction from the Almighty. In in verse, in chapter 2, sorry, in verse chapter 2, um, verse 1 it talks about um, blowing the trumpet so verse 1 it says blow the trumpet in Zion sound the alarm on my holy hill let all who live in the land tremble for the day of the Lord is coming it is close at hand a day of darkness and gloom a day of clouds and blackness um, so that trumpet is a trumpet of warning it's a warning about the impending danger um, and it represents the coming, the coming uh, judgment. Um, it goes on in chapter two, um, verse twelve, uh, where God is calling the people to rend their hearts, um, and and it says, "Even now, declares the Lord, return to me with all your heart, with fasting and weeping and mourning." Rend your heart and not your garments. Return to the Lord your God, for he is gracious and compassionate, slow to anger and abounding in love. And he relents from sending calamity. Who knows, he may turn and have pity and leave behind a blessing. So that is calling about um, a, a returning to God, about people people's hearts being turned back to God. Um um, but it also talks about um, uh, integrity and, and holiness and uh, the people really sort of um, getting their act together and, and returning and returning to him. Um, because it goes it goes on then in, in verse 15 of, of chapter two, it says, blow the trumpet in Zion, declare a holy fast, call a sacred assembly, gather the people, consecrate the the assembly and and yes so that again is 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 calling people to repentance so the first trumpet was um a trumpet of warning um and then the second trumpet is is a trumpet of calling people to repentance and to prayer um and uh it it, it, it is saying that um you know blowing that trumpet it is it's saying the divine intervention is needed and, and it's the only hope it's the only hope so whereas the first trumpet is warning it's the second one is coming to god in prayer and repentance um yeah but because that, that that's what's needed um uh, it it goes on then in chapter three to um uh, verse 14 um that the chapter is about the nations are judged it says multitudes multitudes in the valley of decision, for the day of the Lord is near. Yeah, it goes on then to say, the day of the Lord is near, and and there are multitudes and multitudes in that valley of decision. And I think now more than ever, where people are thinking about their mortality and 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 questioning what's going on and and, and questioning their priorities. Um, yeah, they're in that valley of decision, and and we just felt that God was saying to 
to us as Galway New Life Church in, in the picture that Jane brought is that we need to be blowing those trumpets. We need to be blowing those trumpets of warning and calling the people to repentance. Um, and also we need we need to be coming to, to prayer. Um, uh, and I don't know whether um, th this is something that, that uh, we feel as a church we need to do, um, you know, where God is saying, call up, say, sacred assembly gather the people together whether we need to and it would have to be online obviously at the moment whether we need to have have a meeting where we just come and we just call out to god and we just come come in prayer and and, and fast if we feel to fast um yeah and i, I don't want it to come across as a, ne a negative uh, message um you know warning and 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 um you know, warning the people to come to repentance is, is serious. It's about life and death um, and, and the coming judgment. But it's a blowing those trumpets of the good news that we have, you know, in, in blowing those trumpets with the gospel message um, of, of hope, um, of, of salvation and saying to the people, look, that there's 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 an answer to this. There, there's there, there's there's a way out, way out of this. There's there's a. Uh, uh, an avenue for to be saved and um, yeah and so we just want to blow that those trumpets of, of the good news of the gospel message and of salvation okay guys I hope I hope that makes sense and I wasn't jumping about too much um, okay bye now bye